You wear it, I'm wear it. You wear it, I'm wear it. Yeah. You wear it, I'm wear it. You wear it. That nigga Rocky checking in. You wear it, I'm wear it. You already know I'm wear it. I'm wear it. You wear it, I'm wear it. You wear it, I'm wear it. You wear it. With it. All my niggas tryna get it, you with it, I'm with it Yo bitch gon' let me hit it, she with it, I'm with it Got the city on my fit it, you with it, I'm with it And we ready to be about it, we talk it, we live it Drink her crown oil, I'm with it These niggas know that I'm with it, you with it, I'm with it These bitches know that I'm with it, she on it, I'm on it They don't do the shit how I did it Look, we're here at the 2013, the first of the 2013 H-Town Sneaker Summit. I'm Eric, I'm the owner of Tits Brand. Two in the shirt. And currently, I'm at Capone's for our Tits party. The, uh, I think we call it the kickoff party. Tits Brand, we're we're you know, we've, been, uh, we've been around since 06. What we do is we take uh, photo shoots of girls, we take that image, put it on t-shirts with a concept, and we sell a bunch of them around the world. Um, and now that we're getting uh, bits in a lot, um, I take it as a compliment because it is a compliment that we've been able to create a lane for other people to drive in. Um, it would be good if I can get some uh, kudos and maybe a thank you here and there for um, driving in my lane. But you know, sometimes just people just barge in your lane and they just tend to drive there, but they always get out of your lane. Especially when you're the first one to make that lane. You know, a lane of your own, man, and, and you know, a lot of people, you know, have have, you know, been drawn to that, bro. Talk about that, man. Just talk about how they've been able to uh, you know, come and say, man, we like it, we love this brand, man. Talk about that. Yeah, we. Uh, yeah, I mean, basically, uh, a lot of people, a, they hate the word tits, um, so they're like, you know, fuck that. And B, they hate that we've been able to take regular models, porn stars, up and comers, video vixens, put them on t-shirts. Um, they hate for that, they hate because we actually make money and sell a lot of shirts. Um, and I think there's just, what I call, instead of calling the closet haters, I call them closet lovers. Most people love the fuck out of what we do, they just don't like to admit it outwardly in public. So, maybe you should call this interview closet lovers. Okay? Real simple. Gotcha. They love what we do, they just can't say it out because they think their cool guy buddy, you know, might not think they're cool because they like Tits Brand. Everybody fucking likes Tits Brand. Get over it. We're going to be here. We're going to go nowhere. The uh, business is about supply and demand. And the last I checked, on supply of models? Are you fucking kidding me? Those things grow on fucking trees like lima beans. And as far as demand, there's plenty of demand, so we're not going nowhere. Got supply covered, got demand covered, and then the rest is just like the crack gate, real simple. So you've been doing this for about six years. Talk about, you know, just staying relevant in the game and... Well, the way we've been able to stay, stay relevant is that we stay shooting the most relevant girls in the game. Um, you know, we stay in with the in crowds. We keep on doing events like H-Town and different type of events around the country that support different little local markets. So we're always going to be uh, have a fan base in those different type of markets. Uh, Houston is definitely one of our biggest markets. It's amazing out here. And just the amount of love that people show in Houston, I don't know. I mean, it's almost too much love that people show in Houston. But I fucking love it. Every time I come out of here, everybody's been great. But uh, yeah, you know, we've been able to really create this lane just out of... Uh, sure because we fucking wanted to not because we wanted to be cool or look at girls or any of that shit we just did it because we did it i mean there's really no you know want to be cool or need to be cool i don't think what i wear makes me cool i think the type of money i make makes me cool and the type of people that i keep in my company makes me cool so i'm not worried about being a cool guy real simple once you get over wanting to be a cool guy then you can get on with making money so what's the what's the future hold for tits, man? Well, the future hold for tits. All the same shit, man. I, you know, I wish I had some like grand scale plan of like opening up strip clubs and shit like that. But we're not doing none of that, man. We're just putting the best looking women on the best shirts with the best designers in the industry, and pretty much keep on doing what we've been doing, supporting all the local markets. You know, not trying to be something we're not. We're, you're not going to see any tits jeans. You're not going to see any tits loafers. We're going to see doing t-shirts and accessories like we do. Real simple, nothing, nothing too much behind it. We just do what we do. It's real simple. Fuck, it's so simple. 
It really is. Simplicity. Not much to it. Simplicity and originality because the reason why people flow to us is because we have original content. This picture right here, I own this picture. Nobody, you can't find this picture on the, on the internet. You can't pilfer and pilch this you know, image off the internet. You can't do that. We own it. It's our original content. We shot it. That's what we do. Now, you can go try to imitate the formula that we made. You can go try to steal images off the web. You can even try to steal our images. That's fine with me. But just know that we do the original content. And that's why we stay relevant. And that's why we're still here. So you plan on being here for quite a while. What's up? I'm Eric, owner of Tits. I'm here with the SO Network. Hello hip hop. Goodbye music. It's like a love hate relationship. Riding in the Ferrari while taking trips. Compared to beer taking sips. Sitting somewhere in a Camaro with racist strips. Either way you embrace it. Can't no amount of money your lady replace it. And after all this rhyming. If I